time for the show where your creativity fills in the blanks. It's And now, here's your host, David Sedoni. What's happening, everybody? Welcome to Mad Libs, the greatest word game in the whole wide world. A Mad Lib is a story that's missing a few words, and it's up to you to fill in the blanks with your own creative words. Today we got two teams that are going to be running around playing a bunch of physical and mental games to try and take that Mad Lib off of the page and bring it to life right here. But that's enough talk about it. What do you say we get to it? Bring on the team! Who are teams all? We'll start over here on the red team. Josh, how are you doing, buddy? Great. Tell me about yourself. What's your favorite thing about school? Um, I'm school president. Oh, uh, you like that because you can just tell everyone what to do, huh? Of course. Do you have any great rules, like no homework or anything like that? No. Teachers don't let you get away with that? No. All right. Well, it's good to have you here today. Good luck to you, Josh. Your teammate over here is Megan. Megan, how are you doing? Fine. Good. Tell me about yourself. Uh, what do you like to do on weekends and stuff like that? Well, in the winter, I snowboard. Cool. Can you do any big flips and tricks, or do you just go straight down the mountain? Straight down the mountain. <laughs> yeah, that's the easy way. <laughs> Let's meet their opponents over here. The blue team. How you doing, blue team? I'm good. How are you? Good, good. Okay, Savannah, why don't you tell us about yourself? You know, we got to be getting all kinds of words here today, so uh -huh. what good words do you know? Well, actually, I really like to speak in Japanese. Ooh, give me some. Okay, I'm going to count from one to ten. Okay. Itch, ni, san, chi, go, roko, shishi, hachi, ku, ju. Wow, all right. What were the first two? It's me. It's me. It's me. All right. Let's find out about your teammate over here. How, how you doing, Colby? Fine. Tell me about yourself. You play any sports, dude? Yeah, I skateboard and, and I play else? soccer. Cool. Which one do you like better, skateboarding or soccer? Skateboarding. Yeah? Do you do vertical stuff or street stuff? Street. Cool. Good to have you here. That's our team. Give it up for them. Wish you some good luck, huh? Guys, as always today, we're going to put some dynamite in your dictionary as these two teams compete to earn points to move on to the Maximum Mad Lib, where today they're going to have a chance to win a brand new three CD changer stereo system. <laughs> going to be cool. Now to kick things off, we're going to check in with one of our folks at home. We asked one of our viewers to give us a Mad Lib. Let's take a look. Hi, my name is Coleman. I go to Luther Burbank Middle School. I wrote a Mad Lib named Volcano. Volcanoes are very grouchy. When hiking next to one, stay on the lily pad. Also watch out for molten shaving cream spewing from the trout. Have a great game. Thanks, Coleman. All right, we're gonna take Coleman's Mad Lib and turn it into a game. Follow me. Over here, blue team over here. Here's how this one works. Well, first we're gonna start over here. We're gonna take these gigantic fish eggs. We're gonna cruise this way, walk over the lily pads, which are down here. Then you're gonna come over to the nice grouchy volcano, like our viewer Mad Lib said. Then you drop the eggs onto the volcano and be careful because the trout is gonna spew shaving cream eruption. Oh, did I forget to mention you have to bring them over with your butt? Butt to butt. All right, let's put 45 seconds up on the clock. The first team, the team that blows the most up in, tw in 45 seconds, that's our winner. All right, let's put them up on the clock. Teams get in position. The winner of this round is going to get the first 20 points. Are you ready to go? On your mark, get set, go. Now you got to pick them up. Butt to butt, no hands. Here. Come up here, guys. Let's, let's take a look at the scores. Well, we can tell by the buckets. It looks like the uh, blue team ended up getting two of them. The red team ended up getting four fish eggs. Nice job, red team. That means they're our winners. 
Here you go. You guys can clean off a little bit. We know, unless you're, you know, you want to shave later or something like that. All right, the score. That means the red team, you're the first one to get on the board. Red team, they get 20 points. Blue team, no points yet, but we got a whole lot of show left. Are you guys ready to move on to the next round? We all cleaned up. Let's go. We're gonna go over to Matter Than You. Follow me. Matter than who in matter than you. Who's matter than who in matter than you? Now, you guys know you want to be seriously skilled mad liver. You got to have a seriously huge vocabulary because the more words you have, the more options you have to fill in all those blanks. In this game, I'm going to read you guys a category, and it's your job to try and spit out as many words as you can that fit into the category. Each time you do, you take this hot potato. Pass it over to the other team. And then when you spit out a word, you pass it right back. We're gonna keep on going until you can't think of any more words, then you get the big buzzer. That means the category's over, the other team gets five points. And remember, while you're playing, you cannot repeat another player's answer or a different form of the same word, all right? We're gonna give you two minutes to bust through as many of these as we can. Girls, you're first. Guys, you're on deck. Let's put two minutes up on the clock. Girls, here comes your first category, ready? Things in outer space. Go. Mars! Planets! Stars! Space! The moon! Comets! Aliens! Black holes! Meteors! Um, that's about it! Yeah. Alright, that's five points for the blue team. Nice job, girls, though. Great start. Alright, words that begin with the letter R. Go! Rotate! Uh, railroad. Road. Uh, rainbow. Red. Uh, rat. Rainbow. That's a repeat. We already had that one. That's five points for the red team. He knew it as soon as he pushed it. Oh, all right, girls, here comes your category. Parts of speech. Go. Noun. Adjective. Verb. Adverb. Pronoun. Noun. Repeat, that was the first one we had, so that means that's five more for the red team. Next category, ready guys? Words that rhyme with pack. Go. Uh, stack. Snack. Uh, jack. Splat. <laughs> Close, Colby. Colby made up a whole new word. Splat. Oh, All right, that's five points for the red team. Here comes the next one, ready? Things made of glass. Go. Glasses. Windows. Eyeglasses. Form of the same word. Nice try, though. That's five more points for the blue team. Oh, Here we go. Three. Ready? Yeah. Types of classes. Types of classes. Go. Math. Uh, science. Social studies. Uh, history. English. Oh. Peace. That one beat the buzzer. Keep going. Blunt. Oh. Lunch, I don't think it's a class, although I wish it was. That's five points for the red team. We're going to move on. Next one is, that's it. We're out of time. We're out of time. Come on in, guys. Let's take a look at the scores. Come over here, guys. Blue team, nice job. You guys got on the board. You got 10 points, but the red team still in the lead with 40 points. Woo! We got tons more to do, and when we come back, we're going to the big, fat, mega stunt right after this.